What's going on guys, Rafi right here and today we are taking the Maverick for his first oil change. We're going to go to a different dealer this time around because like I said, the dealer that I bought the truck, I don't really like it that much. So they don't do a really good job when it comes to customer service. Um, so yeah, the truck just reached 5,216 miles. The app, the four app says that the oil now is at around 50% live. So I always want to change the oil, you know, around 50% every 5,000 miles. And I don't like it to reach 10,000 miles. I always have to change my oil on all my cars every 5,000 miles. So we're gonna go over there, follow me along. So let's see how this experience goes. And with that said, follow me around. It's gonna be more of a, a kind of vlog style video, getting the oil change, like I said. If you wanna follow me, just remember to hit that like and that subscribe. I do a lot of like four Mavic videos, sneaker reviews, tech reviews, and I was doing also uh, travel videos. So if you're into any of those videos, make sure you hit that like and that subscribe because I'll be posting more videos of Ford Maverick and other things and tech products um, soon. So let's go. The other thing that I want to take the uh, truck over there for is actually to run some testing in it, you know, some tests, some diagnostic tests because in the app, I don't know why every time that I turn off the car, it keeps saying that it's going to preserve battery life. So I don't know if you guys are having that issue. I have a sound system installed here. I have a couple lights and things like that, but that shouldn't be like draining the battery Action. that much. Red light camera ahead. So I want to take them out to see if they can test the battery, see what the life of the battery is. Maybe if I have to replace it or not. Red light camera. And the other thing also is to check any of the sensor because I have one sensor that was turning on, which is something about lamp something can't remember what is a malfunction lamp and it turned on the check engine for some reason i don't even know why it was only did it one time and after that I stayed with that check engine like for two days but then it went away so i kind of want to see if they do a test on that and then kind of ask them why does the bluetooth disconnect so much you know i keep uh, mentioning this and i keep saying this but i don't hear a lot of people saying it that the bluetooth disconnects a lot and when it's plugged in, it works fine, you know, via the CarPlay. But when it comes to being Bluetooth, uh, after a while, it keeps disconnecting. And I don't know if I'm the only one having this issue or other people. That's pretty much about it. Those are the two kind of complaints that I'm going to ask them to see if they can, you know, check it out. Other than that, the Maverick has been fine, has been great, no issues. So let me know in the comments down below if that's an issue that you guys have been having, like Bluetooth disconnecting a lot or not. I really would like to know if I'm the only one having this issue or not. So, If you guys haven't seen uh, my previous videos with the uh, last fit light for the uh, rear, the brake light, take a look at that video. They're, they look awesome. They, are, they shine a lot. You know, they are super bright. I highly recommend those lights. So I'll put a link in the description down below for you to watch that video and all the other videos as well when it comes to last fit they i love the lights there the lights are great so check that out check the link in the description down below and remember you can get 10 percent off with the purchase of any of those lights with my code rafi red 10 i highly recommend that check them out let me know all right guys so we brought the maverick right here so we can change the oil uh, i just want to do the first time want to make sure that the dealer does it for the first time right here uh it is the fx4 package so it does have a lot of like plates underneath over there so i wanted to uh work with that and do that i also want to get my tires uh my rotation on the tires done and everything so and also kind of want to use my points as the reason why i brought it here to the uh dealer so i'm going to show you here at the front what's oh, nice right here and then going around as well. That's everything good. So, buddy here is to do the oil change and rotation and do the works. Let's go. All right, guys. So, I just got back here to my truck. They finished doing the service. 
uh, and the Maverick and I got the works which is kind of like replacing the oil they do a lot of tire rotation they do a battery inspection and a couple of other stuff as well I got the synthetic blend I normally go for the synthetic full synthetic uh, on all my cars but on this one you know super brand new uh, that was the one that was you know that I could get with my points so I said why not let's do the the blend synthetic blend uh, make sure that they use you know the proper oil and oil filter and things like that and tight rotation like I said check the battery all the different kind of stuff so since I had the points I did that one yeah it's pretty good everything was visible everything was good so no problems there the battery is at full which is weird because as I mentioned guys before the I keep getting the message on the app on the pass uh four pass app that the system for the remote uh unlocking and locking the car and turning it on gets turned off every single time that i turn off the car because to preserve battery life i don't know how i can i turn that off so i can keep it on so if i ever want to unlock the car or lock the car or even turn on the car i can do it remotely that didn't used to happen before it was always on but after a few you know months ago now it started happening well we just send me the push notification every time that i turn off the the truck and it's kind of annoying i don't want that to happen so you know it's something that i kind of need to look into it to see if actually the battery is in good condition or, or there's a feature that i could turn off because you know that's annoying that's the whole purpose to have the, that feature you know if you wanted to turn on the car so the ac can start cooling or if you want to unlock the car for someone you know for yourself uh, so that that's pretty much it so everything good so far now a quick tip that i recommend you guys do so that way you guys are you know aware that they do what they were supposed to be doing i did a mark on the tires you know i marked the tires wherever their position were so when i come back i can see that the mark uh has moved so definitely that lets you know that they actually moved the tires around which i'm glad that they did but also you want to come back here to the main screen and then let's see so you go back to settings and then you want to go to vehicle and then oil life and you see it says uh percent oil life indicators 100 percent if they wouldn't have done that then there might be some suspicion that they didn't do it right uh so you want to check that out also before you like start driving the car check that the oil is also up to date and fully loaded so and probably next time i might do the oil change myself just to one show you guys but also for me to learn how to do it as well i've done all my oil changes in my previous cars i didn't do it on the mini i always take it to the dealer on the mini because that was a lot more complicated but I did it all the time on my Mazda 3 hatchback. So we'll see. Let's see how this goes. Um, hope you guys like this video. And if you did, be that kind person to hit that like and subscribe and share the content if this video kind of helped you out. If you have any questions, also let me know in the comments down below. Remember to check those lights, the description box below, the lights from Last Fit. And if you want to be, you know, kind, also hit that thanks button. That way it will be a good support for this channel. So with that said, thank you guys for watching. This is Rafi Red, signing out.